<laughs> you want to be in my video, yes or no? Yes. Yeah. Okay, do you want to sit next to me? Yeah. Want to sit on my lap? Mm -hmm. Okay, but you gotta turn around then. Hello, Tucker Tribe. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today I have a helper helping me assemble the bassinet that we bought for baby brother, right? Are you excited for baby brother? Today we're gonna be putting together the bassinet that we bought for Bennett that's gonna go next to our bed in the bedroom. Uh, we still have yet to assemble the crib and changing table. We lost the bolts for those in storage when we moved. And they were out yesterday at Home Depot, so she's gonna try Lowe's today to see if they do have them at Lowe's. So we are going to put that together, but today, in this video, we will be assembling the bassinet. Let's get started. So the bassinet that we chose is by Venice Child. I will link it in the description box below. I got it off of Amazon. I actually saw it on Riley Jade's channel on YouTube. I will link her channel here in the description box below as well. She has this one. It was really cute and it's very functional and exactly what kind of we need for our space as well because it's not too big, not too small. I figured we would give this one a try since we never got a bassinet with Kennedy because she was in our room. We were living in a one bedroom condo at the time so her crib was just right next to our bed. So we were able to use that for her but because uh, his crib will be in a different room this time, the bassinet will work out best for us. I'm gonna take it out of the box and try to assemble it the best that I can. Chase moved it in here for me. It's not too heavy actually. I probably probably could have moved it myself, but Chase did move it in here for me this morning so that way I could assemble it while he was at work today. Are you ready? First things first, it comes with this really cool carrying case because it is portable. That's one of the features is that you can kind of bring it anywhere that you want. So um, this will be great for us when we do take our Disneyland trip for her birthday because we can bring this with us um, and kind of use it in the hotel room. I was getting a little dehydrated. Okay, so let's try this one more time. that I bought this one is that this actually comes down like this and there are little buttons so that way you can use it as a co-sleeper with your bed so you adjust it on the side here to the height of what your bed is you can go up and down and, and then you can use it as a co-sleeper so the baby is sleeping right next to your bed or you can just leave it up like it was these clip back in, this zips up, and you can just use it like a regular bassinet. A cool feature about this co-sleeping bassinet is that it comes with all of the tools needed to connect it to your bed, so that way it's completely snug up against your bed the entire night. It doesn't accidentally drift away or create a space that the baby can fall into. This connects to your bed frame and there are directions on how to connect it to your bed frame to make sure that it stays nice and tight up against your mattress. So there's a little lock on the bottom that if you unhook it here, you can shake it by hand, like a rocking motion to help the baby fall asleep. And then if you don't want it to be able to shake like while the baby is asleep, you just lock it in place and then it does doesn't rock. Here's a locking mechanism I was talking about earlier, but you basically push that in and it stops it from rocking 
because it kind of locks into this thing here like that and then if you want it to rock you just pull it out like this oh that's how i did on the other one let's see oh maybe you have to push this button yeah you push the button and pull it out and then you can rock it pretty pretty neat and then here's how you close it up if you want to close the legs you push the button and then it closes up the legs and yeah i love the color i like this natural looking wood color i like the gray it's very very cute so here's some close-ups of the crib after it's been assembled it has this little ledge right here and i have a basket a couple baskets that i'm going to put down there so that'll be cute here is where you can adjust it to the height of your bed. It has some different numbers here and the numbers correspond with different heights, which are in the manual. So you can kind of know where you need to put it. So this is Chase and I's room at my father-in-law's house. Here's Kennedy. I lost my helper. She's watching a Minecraft video now. She's getting ready to take her nap. That's why she has her passy and her blankie here. And over here is where we are going to keep baby brother for a little bit. Obviously I know safe sleep, Nothing goes in the bassinet. Just kind of putting this stuff here for now um, until he comes. But this is my Barefoot Dreams blanket that I love, love, love. I use it pretty much every day. Um, I got this boppy cover from Target. Um, I had like a pink floral one for Kennedy. So I picked up this green leafy one for him. I think it'll be great in this window. It'll get him a little bit of extra light if he needs it. I think it's a great little spot for it. And again, we can pull it right here, right up next to the bed if we need to. It doesn't really give me that much walking room, but I can shimmy. I think this is going to be a great little piece for our room for baby brother. I'll make sure to do a full review on the Venice Child bassinet once we've used it for a couple months. But right now, I'm totally loving the aesthetic. I'm loving the color. I'm loving the size. I love that it's portable and that it came with a bag so that I can transport it a lot easier than just throwing the pieces into a car. I will let you guys know in a couple months. I'll do a second review on like how it's working out. But so far, I really love it. Um, again, I've linked everything in the description below. So if you guys are interested in anything that I showed you in this video, go ahead and click on those links um, in the description. Shout out to Riley Jade for her recommendation of this bassinet. It's really, really cute and I love it. Please make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and ring the bell. That way you're notified every time we post a new video. And we'll see you guys later. Bye guys.